Hello and welcome to the Titus Timeout Podcast. I'm Jenny Abney Civi, and today I'm going to answer the question, what is a BMS? BMS stands for Building Management System. It also is referred to as a BAS, Building Automation System. The BMS consists of hardware and software that controls the systems in a building. Let's move this up here. Usually it covers at least the HVAC and lighting system, but it can also cover security, plumbing, and much more. There are several different protocols. The ones you hear about mostly in our industry are BACnet, LawnWorks, and Modbus. So those are good topics for maybe a future podcast. The front end of a BMS is usually a program that allows the building facility people to look at the whole system and see what's going on in the building. Are the air handlers working correctly? What's the airflow of the VAV boxes? Is anything an alarm? And so on. Building management systems vary in complexity, but with a BMS, you can adjust set points throughout the system without having to go into the space, saving time for the facility people and allowing them to respond faster to hot and cold calls. Let's make room again. The BMS can also provide off-site access to view the building systems remotely. One benefit to a BMS is that the owner can optimize the building performance and see that it's running as commissioned. You can get real-time data about operation, and you can get data trends and reports about how the building is operating. The HVAC systems use about 40% of the energy in a building, and lighting can be another 30%. So knowing that the HVAC system is running correctly, say it's in night set back at night, and that the lights are off at night, can save a lot of energy and therefore money for a building owner. So that's what a BMS is. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and thanks for taking a time out with us.